Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you the Arc'teryx Rust Jacket, one of the pinnacle jackets in the Arc'teryx ski line. So this jacket is a three-layer Gore-Tex. It is designed with the backcountry skier in mind. It's got a regular fit. It's 1.3 ounces, so it trims some weight from some of the heavier jackets from Arc'teryx. And it's got a heavy-duty Gore-Tex outer and inner, so that if you're constantly putting your gear to the test, this is going to be the jacket for you. If you're really hard on your stuff like I am, this is the way to go. It's got definitely got some features that's gonna, that I'll point out to you along the way that you'll see are definitely designed for the backcountry skier in mind. But it's still a great jacket for all around use as well. because It's going to keep you warm, it's going to keep you dry in all conditions. So let's get into it. So on the outside of the jacket, we've got a lot of the standard Arc'teryx features, a good, easy to work, waterproof zipper. Uh, this is important so that you can do, use it with one hand. Um, it also has, so these pockets are really large. This is what I love so much about Arc'teryx is they do, they simple down, they, this is what I love about Arc'teryx. They simplify the jacket, they eliminate a lot of the need for all the extra pockets that add more fabric, more zippers, more materials, and they, and they make these pockets really large. So of all the Arc'teryx ski shells that are Gore-Tex, this, these jackets, de the rust jacket definitely has some of the largest pockets. You can even see how they add an extra uh, material here so it can actually bellow and give you more space. So that's so you can hold things like a radio and, uh, and things like that that you need to get to while you're backcountry skiing. So really, really good jacket here. It's got a side pocket up here. I use this for chapstick or if I'm on the resort, I use it for a uh, radio frequency lift ticket uh, that's, that's up high and easy to get to. Uh, it's got pit zips, so if you're doing high aerobic activity, specifically skiing is, but if you're uh, doing things like hiking or skinning up a mountain, um, you can open it up, get some cool air in there, and it makes it really, really easy to get, some, get comfortable when you're steaming hot, especially if it's snowing and the elements are coming down. So that's the exterior of the jacket. It's got pull strings on the, on the hood. It's got a, uh, something that'll take the volume out of the hood. So if you don't want to wear your ski helmet and, and you're using the jacket for other purposes and you have the elements coming down, you can take the volume out of the hood and it makes it smaller so it fits over a baseball cap or a beanie or something like that. There's also a cinch on the back, give you a little more protection around the neck. And there's cinches on the front as well on each side right here that'll come down and allow you to shrink the opening in the, in the hood if you are in some really extreme conditions. What I really like about this jacket that you don't see in other jackets is that when you zip it all the way to the top, even when you have a, a ski, uh, even when you have a helmet on or a neck gaiter, it'll go all the way to the top. A lot of times you'll see jackets in the collar when you have a helmet on, they get tight and they stay open and they don't zip all the way up not these jackets. Arc'teryx, jacket, Arc'teryx has that in mind when they design these jackets, so it makes it super um, uh, utilitarian for getting that zipper all the way to the top to cover your mouth. That's a big deal. Um, so other little things I want to point out to you before we open up the jacket and show you the inside is going to be the taped seams on it. The Arc'teryx is one of the only jacket makers that you'll ever see that you cannot see any stitching. No visible stitching, it's all tape seams. There's nothing in there that's gonna get caught, that's gonna come undone. It's, it's something that you just don't see in very many jackets. And it's an incredible product feature uh, that they use in a process called Tiny Tape. And um, you're not gonna beat it with any other jacket. So uh, let's, got, let's dive on into the jacket and see what's on the uh, inside. I'll also tell you that it will, you can also tighten it, tighten the bottom of the uh, jacket as well by pulling these strips and it'll tighten up on the bottom. So, okay. All right. So, one of the big differences between this and something like the Saber jacket is the, uh, this is going to be a true Gore-Tex liner on the inside. It does not have like a fleece, but what that is, is that gives you more breathability for uh, hardcore uh, aggressive skiing because when you perspire 
and your body is activated and you've got all that perspiration pushing through, this is gonna give you a little bit more of that element of more breathability with the lightweightness of being able to wear this in a lot of different temperature ranges. Something like the Sabre jacket is gonna have that fleece liner so it's gonna be geared a little bit towards a cooler environment whereas you can wear this if it's snowing down wet rain, you're spring skiing and it's that wet snow, it's, you're gonna be able to wear this even when it's warm. So um, that's one of the big features of the feature differences between this and other jackets. It's a regular, it's also a regular fit to eliminate some of the fabric and it's about hip length, 31.5 uh, inch center back length on a size medium. Um, full powder skirt on this product. It has the snaps on the powder skirt that'll allow you to snap it into the uh, Arc'teryx pants. It also has the, um, it's got two waist sizes on here. For the powder skirt, you can snap it in on this closer, the closer two snaps or the inner two snaps. On the outer two snaps or the inner two snaps. Um, it's got a large pocket over here, which is great for gloves, goggles. Uh, you can fit a lot of stuff. Again, Arc'teryx makes their product very simple by eliminating extra pockets. Uh, so they use several big pockets instead of having you know, a whole bunch of, they use, they use uh, three big pockets and then this one small pocket instead of having a whole bunch of little pockets like some jackets have. Um, so another small pocket right here. It's got the, again, helmet compatible hood, drawstring on the bottom, pit zips. And you'll see they do, I'll t <laughs> they even go down to the detail of making sure that the logo is waterproof on the, from the inside with Cortex something you don't see from a lot of jacket companies. So that is the Rush Jacket in a nutshell. Hopefully you can come see us in our stores and come check it out. It's a great product. I highly recommend that you get this if you're, def if you're an aggressive skier. And don't forget, be sure to visit us online at www.backpackeroutdoors.com or in one of our stores in Baton Rouge and Lafayette.